I'm Loz. Hi, I'm Shani and we're from Babes in Business and we teach people how to build a successful business from home. I was always taught from a young age, do really well at school, get into university, smash your degree, get a great job and then climb that corporate ladder. I wasn't afraid of hard work, like I was, I was excited and ambitious to finish university and grow in that career. I couldn't take my annual leave because I had to be at work. There's no way I could take sick leave because I needed to be there. For me, in that situation in my early 20s, I just thought I can't do this for the rest of my life. I couldn't picture myself working 50 plus hours a week for the next 50 plus years. I just, I couldn't do it. So that was probably one of my biggest lessons. And I'm really grateful for that experience because had that not happened, I probably wouldn't have pursued this awesome business. I think women really can have it all. We can have health, we can have wealth, we can have abundance. But in the pursuit of achieving that, I think we forget having it all doesn't actually mean having more than the woman next to you. So Babes in Business is all about sharing our strategies, sharing what works. I think a lot of women in our, our age, we look at our parents and we realise we want more from life. And it's not about working harder, it's about working smarter. So we have this thing called social media at our fingertips and we've really been able to leverage off that in Babes in Business. It's such a beautiful culture of people that are just so like-minded and super passionate. It's a really beautiful community where people just support one another. We share what works, what doesn't work. We celebrate each other's triumphs, which I love. And you know, there's no competition, there's, no, there's none of that. People always say that as you grow, your business grows. So we put a lot of time and effort into our personal growth, not just our business growth. I didn't know what this could be for me. I just knew that if not this, then what? So as I started getting into all the training and all the support that I was getting from all the other beautiful babes in business, I really got to learn more about myself and what I wanted in life, what was important to me. And as I started to grow my business grew. It's about having that time and freedom to do things that are important to me. It's about having time for friends, family, the beach, yoga, enjoying my mornings again, no longer having to commute. Those things that really have me lit up and inspired again and dreaming. And when I think of where I was 12 months ago, I definitely lost that sparkle. Whether you're someone who wants to do this as a hobby on the side, whether you're someone who wants to own your own business and do this full time, there really, there really is a space for everyone. Now I'm working from home for myself on my own terms, like Loz said, like doing yoga and beach and no alarm clocks and just living life on our own terms. And not just working from home, but working anywhere in the world. So travel's a biggie, I know, on both of our lists. So we can take our business anywhere we want. We're a bit like, we're digital nomads, really. <laughs> And I love that we've got people from their early 20s, you know, at university to people who are really successful businesswomen already who have just decided to give this a go, to full-time mamas at home who don't want to put their kiddies in daycare anymore, they'd want to be at home and have those magic moments with them, all the way through to people in their 40s, 50s, it really does cater for anyone. I can't wait to see what happens. I mean, I really think we're making a massive impact in people's lives and, and showing people that there's more to life. And I'm just really excited to share that with people. I, I'm, I don't want to hide it. What's the point of concealing it from anyone? Like, I really believe that anyone can have this. I love linking arms with like-minded women who want more for themselves, more for their loved ones. Women who love to travel, who want to be gypsies, want to be digital nomads. Women who have that entrepreneur in them that drive to be more, do more, see more, help more. So it's a beautiful, a beautiful environment, a beautiful culture to bring those kind of women together. And it's crazy what empowered women, empowering other women can achieve. If you're curious to find out more, I really urge you to connect with the person who's shared this with you or wherever you may have found this video. The biggest mistake I made was not ask questions in the beginning and I could have said yes to this much sooner. We can't wait to meet you. <laughs> <laughs>